I wasn't sure what to do today because I'm really running out of ideas because I've covered everything there is to cover. But someone's bringing their Motorola Click today and I'm going to install CyanEngine on it. And I tried Super One Click and it never worked. I also tried Visionary. That wouldn't work. So I'm going to try something else. I'm going to go to my Android folder, Samsung, Intercept, and then this one. Even though this is not an Intercept, I'm still going to try this. It had a problem with the 3G because the signal here sucks and it finally connected to my Wi-Fi. So this should go a whole lot faster. Permanent route. Oh, it rebooted, and I promise you, I swear to God, that this was completely stock. Stock recovery, stock kernel, stock everything. Alright, let's see what About Phone says. It appears to be the same exact way it was before. Open Titanium Backup. So there is root, and you can root your phone using one little APK, that's all. I get questions all the time, what's the easiest way to root my phone? My drivers aren't detected. And you can use Joey Krim's Flash Image UI program to flash recoveries and kernels to it. Sweet. No more Sprint ID, and we have root. And I'll show you that there's no custom recovery either. And I'll show you that I do not have custom recovery right now. Volume down, voice button, power button. Let go. Stock recovery, stock kernel, stock ROM. All I have is root. And if you can't press this button, if you can't press camera, then you have stock recovery. You gotta hit the voice button. I will have a video on the Flash Image UI so that people can get root from just installing an APK. And then you can install an app that lets you flash recoveries and kernels that requires root. So essentially you don't need a computer at all, which I've probably got hundreds of comments and messages about that. Software upgrade won't recognize my phone. Is there any other way to root it? And this is that way. And like I said, you have stock recovery and you have a stock kernel. All you have is root access, so Flash Image UI from Joey Cram will flash other recoveries and other kernels to your phone. That was requested by the Robert One a long time ago. And I'm finally going to do it because there's a way to root it without using the computer. I am getting an Evo 3D and my wife is really considering the Evo Shift. So I'll be doing videos on the Evo Shift and the Evo 3D here in the next couple weeks. The Evo 3D is not rooted as of this video. But as soon as it is rooted, I will have a video on how to do so. And like I said, hopefully by next Tuesday or Wednesday, I will have a video on how to root the Motorola Click and install CyanogenMod on it. This is What Would Josh Do? And I'm out.